So like I said, last video is the cashmere mats. I have, um, I believe most of them are the mats from um, the fall. So fall 2014. And then I have, well, I have one large from the spring collection. And um, I have the whole spring collection in mini, but they will be all at a later date. So let's go ahead and get these out of the way. I have, um, I'm doing the spring one first. So this is mm, Yes Bedrills. And this is the green with the green shimmer. And as far as the cashmere mats go, I only like really the ones with the shimmer. They had the two pinky color ones at Ulta on clearance too, but for some reason I didn't get them. Um, the darker pink I don't like too much. I don't think it's a good tone on me, but um, yeah, I don't know. I just love the cashmere mats with the shimmer. I think they look so velvety and I don't know. I am a big fan of matte nails. However, I don't wear them all that often. Um, not quite sure why, um, but I don't, and I don't. So let's go ahead and do our swatch right there of Yes Bedrills. And amazingly for matte polishes um, and it being Essie, <laughs> I actually think the formula on all of these is really, really good. Okay, so next up, <clears throat> we're going to go to the fall of 2014, I believe. And we have... And, you know, it took my Walmart, or sorry, my Rite Aid until summer 2015 to either get these or put them out. Which really friggin' pisses me off. It's kind of nice in a way because then by the time the hype of the collection is over, they're putting them out and I can still manage to get them. Um, but still, I just wish they'd put them out earlier. I don't, I just don't know. Like, because... I'm hyped up about it when a collection comes out. I want the fucking collection. Like, Simple Colors is killing me with all of these collections. And I can't find half of them. It sucks. So here is Just Stitched. It's a very pretty baby pink with this greenish blue shimmer. When it's dry, it just looks, it looks like it glows. And I think that's why I like these mattes like this so much. So here is Just Stitched. And I don't know, I heard people say that they had issues with the formulas on these. Mine, I, I didn't have an issue with any of the formulas. So, do you see how that kind of just like glows there? I think it's so pretty. Next up is Coat Couture. And this one was like my absolute favorite because it's kind of like this dusty purple with this beautiful blue ass freaking shimmer. I mean, look at that, guys. How could you not want this polish? I just think this is fucking spectacular. I mean, I hand it to Essie on these ones. Because, I mean, these might not be everybody's thing. But, shit. Here is the first coat of 
coat couture. Oops. Yeah, because this one is a little bit of a darker color, you can tell it's a little streaky on its first coat. But that's okay. I forgives it. Gotta shake them, guys, because I haven't worn them. <laughs> Other than swatching them when I first got them. <laughs> this one, also, Comfy in Cashmere. It's kind of like a taupey brown with that same beautiful glowing blue shimmer. Mm, man, I just love these. Did you ever have a polish? <laughs> and I mean, you know, it takes a long time to wear them. I mean, unless you're like putting four coats on. But like, <laughs> you know, it takes a while to go down in a bottle of polish. But did you ever become afraid to use it? Because you're going to run out of it. Oh, that happens to me all the time. I'm afraid to use these because I don't want them to run out. A lot of my indies, too, I was like that. I didn't want to use them because, oh, no. You know, with indies, a lot of them are, are like, limited and shit. And <laughs> if you use them, then you got to pay, like, umpteen million dollars just to get a bottle. Like, when I bought La La Land from Enchanted, um, and I bought it from a person on Pinterest, I was so worried because I was thinking, oh, it's going to be used so much. And it really wasn't. Like, I mean, look at down there. It's still pretty full. I mean, it's just a little bit below the neck there. Like, right about this area. And I was like, oh, yes. It was well worth the money I paid for it. And I, I mean, I don't mind buying a polish from a sale, uh, a swap or something like that. Um, I just don't want it to be half empty. Like, um, where is my Smittens? Smitten, where are you? I don't know where the Smitten polishes are. Oh my God, right in front of me. Okay, so this polish here is Tornado Skies. And... You can see I purchased this off of eBay for like $30. And it's there on the level. But look at it. Like, I don't give a shit. This was worth it. Have I worn it yet? Mm -mm. No. <laughs> but it's so pretty. It is so pretty. Yes. That smells. <laughs> it stinks. I don't know why. Anyway, next up is Spun and Lux. This one I needed to have. Because it's blue. Mm, there's different colors in there, kind of, sort of. Yes, please. Over and over and over again. First coat of Spun in Lux. Okay, so I'm going to go back around to the Yospadrils. And I'm going to go up closer. Like, look at how pretty that is. It's so, I'm so... Not comfortable today. My stamp album is digging me in the freaking leg. <laughs> okay, so two coats of Yes Bedrills. And I'm going over it a couple times. And you know with like a lot of matte polishes how if you go over it <clears throat> more than once sometimes 
it kind of drags it off. Not the case. <clears throat> Just stitched. Look at how it glows. Let's get rid of that ball here. It friggin' glows. And that's one coat. So let's go ahead and do two coats. So that is two coats of just stitched. <clears throat> Next is coat couture. And again, all five of these, in my opinion, have great formulas. I think as far as these go, um, you guys need them. If you don't already own them, I do think that these are definite needs for your collection. Whether you like matte or not. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to let them dry. And then I'm going to put a top coat on them as well. So you can see, I mean, obviously, glossy is wet. But... It's always nice to see them with a top coat anyway. And last is the Spun in Lux. And I mean, this one's really pretty, but it kind of pisses me off because, I mean, the shimmer doesn't come through all that much, and it just looks black. Okay, so give me a minute. Uh, let them dry, and I'll come back. Okay, so these are dry. So here is Yes Bedrills. Just stitched. It just gives it a nice glow there. Coat Couture. Comfy in Cashmere. And Spawn in Lux. Those purples that are in there kind of come out a little bit. Okay, give me a minute. I'm going to top coat, and I'll be back with the top coat to show you. Okay. So here they are top coated. And there is Yes Bedrills. And it just brings the shimmer out a little bit more. It just stitched. Looks really pretty. It's more sparkly now than, um, like, glowing iridescent-y. Coat Couture. And that blue shimmer really stands out even more. Again, it gives it more of a sparkly look than a satiny kind of look. And it is, um, Coat... No, whatever the fuck the name of it is. Comfy and Cashmere. And comfy and Cashmere kind of reminds me of Ancient, or I'm sorry, Bury the Hatchet Fish from um, Hair Polish. See that with the blue? <laughs> okay, and then we have Spun in Lux. And it just kind of brings that shimmer out a little bit more, but it's still really dark okay guys so that is it for me for Essie next up is Zoya Woo! but we're gonna wait another day to do the Zoyas because I just did six videos today I believe so I think that's enough for today I hope you all have a great day and I'll see you next time bye